Behold, the sword of art, the great lightning bolt, the phallus of the God. Behold it and beware, all who would do harm or interfere with these sacred workings. I banish you, I cast you out, all negativity, all obstruction, all that would impede the sacred assembly. I send away and forbid to return by this holy blade and the mysteries it represents. And by my will as the focus of the combined will of the Corellian priesthood, I bar this place to all that is impure or injurious to our right. Darkness, light, herself, himself, oneself, forever. 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 May the temple be cleansed and blessed. Yo te exorcizo de la tierra de la tierra, de cualquier energía y vibración negativa que pueda crecer en ti. Y te bendigo, criatura de la tierra para que sirvas aquí y ahora en este trabajo mágico, que así sea. Yo te limpio, criatura del agua, de toda energía negativa y vibración que deba, que no pueda crecer en ti. Te limpio y te libero. Y te bendigo criatura del agua, para que sirvas aquí y ahora en este trabajo humano. Bendita estás, que así sea. La sal es pura y el agua es pura. Pureza la pureza y la pureza bendecida eres. Yo limpio este espacio sagrado, yo te limpio, yo te limpio, te limpio y te bendigo, limpio y bendecido estás, que así sea. Behold, I do exorcise you, O creature of fire, casting out any impurities which may lie within. And I do bless and charge you to this work. Behold, I exorcise you, O creature of air, casting out any impurities which may lie within. And I do bless and charge you to this work. Behold, the fire is pure. Behold, the air is pure. Purity and the purity then, and purity be blessed. Come on. I charge you. 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 May the circle be cast. <laughs> Behold, inspiration, thought, the sacred power of the East, the holy lightning bolt. In the beginning, the God exploded like lightning from within the goddess in obedience to her command. When the earth was not but rock and water, air and fire, it was the lightning striking the water which gave rise to the first organisms. Symbol of creation, phallus of the God, created and directed by the goddess. 
Be now the vehicle of our focused will as we create in our turn a place between the worlds, a time outside of time, a holy enclosure of focused energy for our right. Behold, I do cut apart a place between the realms of humankind and of the mighty ones, a circle of art to focus and to contain the powers we shall raise herein. Behold, the circle is cast. May the higher self be invoked. Behold, I invoke the higher self of the first priestess, Lady Stephanie. May you be one with your higher self, undivided and complete. The veil set aside as we go forward with this holy rite. Behold, I do invoke the higher self of First Priest Lord Don. May you be one with your higher self, undivided and complete, the veil set aside as we go forward in this holy rite. Hear then the words of Our Lady, the First Priestess. I am the weaver of the web. I am Ophala, the inner heart. I am the beloved one of endless years. I call unto you, O ancient ones, in the name of the great family who are charged with the great work. We call upon you as we are, have called upon you from time immemorial, through many lives, and many times and many places. We call upon you from the hinges and barrows of old England, Europe. We call to you from the temples and pyramids of the Nile. We call to you from the caves of the ice ages and before. We call to you from the stars before this world was ever formed. Hear now the words of our Lord, the first priest. I am the binder and the unbinder of time. I am Oribos O'Fallon, the great dragon of the universe. I am the web which the mother has woven and hung with bright stars. I call unto you, O ancient one, in the name of your children who are in truth yourselves. We are your voice and your hands, your dance and your song. It is as it was in the beginning when the universe took form. From the innermost heart of the goddess, we are manifested. Through the steps of her eternal dance with the God, we are the nine who are the one. We are the millions of souls who are the billions of lives. We are the children of light and darkness, and our bodies are the stars made flesh. We call upon you, O ancient and holy one, and bid you be here now. May the 70 gods be invoked. Behold, movement, action, the sacred power of the South. It is the tree of life, ever living, ever growing, ever changing. The axis of the planes through which spirit takes flesh. It is manifestation through which the desires of the heart take form. For when the goddess had created him, the god fled from her, entering the world of matter where the contents of his heart took physical form according to his passions. It is even so for us, symbol of the physical, through which goddess is expressed by God. Be now the vehicle of our prayer as we call upon our relations.
Behold, I invoke you, O ancient ones of the East. I call on to you, O lands, O gods, O peoples of the East, as I have from the beginning. I call you forth. I invoke you with love, with respect, O glorious and beautiful ones. May the red lady of the East rejoice. May the golden Lord of the East open the way. Come forth, join and guide us now, O ancient and holy ones. We call upon you, O countless gods of the East. Parvati, Saraswati, Kali, Shiva, Vishnu, Brahma, Ganesha, Mayare Kabunyan, Kaptan Laon, Malbaya Tuhan, Guan Yin, Tsi Wangmu, Amatarasu, Pele, Hina, Maui, Rongo, you and all who are with you. Join us now from the East. May the blessing of the East be upon you. Loved ones, Elisai, Edujai, you and all the siblings of the great family, in the name of the lands, gods, and peoples of the East, may you and yours be blessed. May the great family rejoice. May every road be open unto you, every gate unbarred, every heart a friend. May the powers of the East be blessed. May clear vision and keen intelligence ever be your disorder. Sumay nyo ang pagpapala ng silanganan. O mga pinakamamahal. LAC, LDJ, ikaw at ang lahat ng iyong mga kapatid na bumubuo sa dakilang pamilya. Sa ngala ng mga kalupaan. Ng mga diwata at ng mga mamamayan ng silanganan. Pagpalain ka at ang lahat ng mga kasama mo. Magdiwang ang dakilang pamilya. Buksan nawa ang lahat ng daan para sa iyo. Ang mga pinto ay walang hadlang. At ang bawat puso ay maging kaibigan. Sa kapangyarihan ng silanganan. Kayo ay maging pinagpala. Magkaroon nawa kayo ng malinaw na pananaw. At masigasig na katalinuhan ang maging inyong punyan. Sumayin nyo ang pagpapala ng silanganan. Behold, I invoke you, O ancient ones of the South. I call unto you, O lands, O gods, O peoples of the South, as I have from the beginning I call you forth. I invoke you with love and with respect, O glorious and beautiful ones. May the white lady of the South rejoice. May the red Lord of the South open the way. Come forth, join and guide us now. O ancient and holy ones. We call upon you, O countless gods of the South. Isis, Osiris, Horus, Bast, Sekhmet, Amon-Ra, Nanabaluku, Epademak, Yamaya, Ashun, Yansa, Elehwa, Shango, Ogun, Orunmila, Obatila, you and all who are with you, join us now from the South. May the blessing of the South be upon you, beloved ones. Elisi, Eduji, you and all the siblings of the great family. In the name of the lands, gods, and peoples of the South, 
May you and yours be blessed. May the great family rejoice. May every road be open unto you, every gate and bar, every heart a friend. By the powers of the South be blessed. May just and effective action ever be your steady staff. Ας είναι οι ευλογίες του Νότου μαζί σας, αγαπημένοι. Ελίση, Εντούτζη, εσείς και όλα τα αδέρφια της μεγάλης οικογένειας, στο όνομα της γης του Νότου, των φιλών και των θεών του Νότου, ας είστε εσείς και όλα τα δικά σας ευλογημένοι. Ας εφραίνεται όλη η μεγάλη οικογένεια. Ας είναι κάθε δρόμος ανοιχτός για εσάς, κάθε πύλη ορθάνυχτη, κάθε καρδιά, και φίλος. Με τις δυνάμεις του Νότου, ας είστε ευλογημένοι. Ας είναι η δίκαιη και αποτελεσματική δράση το κρατεό σας ραβδί. May the blessing of the South be upon you. Ας είναι οι ευλογίες του Νότου μαζί σας. Behold, I invoke you, O ancient ones of the West. I call unto you, O lands, O gods, O peoples of the West, as I have from the beginning, I call you forth. I invoke you with love and with respect, O glorious and beautiful ones. May the gray lady of the West rejoice. May the blue Lord of the West open the way Come forth, join, and guide us now, O ancient and holy ones. We call upon you, O countless gods of the West, Sumuduya, Ganati, Yiroigaehi, Gayagaga, Agia Gananeski, Inagi, Ketsokoat, Tishkanlipoka, Kalshu Likwe, Flakoteyu. Ometeyut, Tlaloc, Apuch, Akin, Ischel, Viracocha, Pachamama, you and all who are with you, join us now from the West. May the blessings be of, of the West be upon you, beloved ones, Elisi, Uji, you and all the siblings of the great family, in the name of lands, gods, and peoples of the West. May you and yours be blessed. May the great family rejoice. May every road be open unto you, every gate unbarred, every heart a friend. By the powers of the West be blessed. May an open heart and psychic vision ever fill your brimming cup. Que la bendición del oeste esté con vosotros. Elisi, Eduji, vosotros y todos los hermanos de la gran familia. En nombre de las tierras, dioses y pueblos del oeste, que vosotros y los vuestros sean bendecidos, que la gran familia se recosije, que cada camino esté abierto para vosotros, que todas las puertas estén destrancadas y en cada corazón encontréis un amigo. Por los poderes del oeste, bendito seáis, que un corazón abierto y la visión psíquica siempre llene vuestras copas. May the blessings of the West be upon you. Que la bendición del Oeste esté con vosotros. Behold, I invoke you, O ancient ones of the North. I call unto you, O lands, O gods, O peoples of the North. As I have from the beginning, I call you forth I invoke you with love and with respect, O oh, glorious and beautiful ones. May the Black Lady of the North rejoice. May the Green Lord of the North open the way. Come forth, join, and guide us now, O oh, ancient and holy ones. We call upon you, O countless gods of the North, 
Apollo, Diana, Ekate, Hermes, Juno, Jupiter, Janus, Marianne, Vril, Daiva, Lou, Kerionos, Rian and Macha, Thor, Odin, Freya, Hela, you and all who are with you, join us now from the north. May the blessing of the north be upon you, beloved ones, Elisi, Eduji, you and all the siblings of the great family, in the name of the lands, gods, and people of the north. May you and yours be blessed. May the great family rejoice. May every road be open unto you, every gate unbarred, every heart a friend. By the powers of the north, be blessed. May wisdom and understanding ever be your novel crown. Que la bendición del norte esté con vosotros. Elisi, Eduji, vosotros y todos los hermanos de la gran familia. En nombre de las tierras, los dioses y los pueblos del norte, que vosotros y los vuestros seáis bendecidos. Que la gran familia se regocije. Que cada camino se abra para todos vosotros. Que las puertas se desatranquen y en cada corazón encontréis un amigo. Por los poderes del norte, benditos seáis, que la sabiduría y el entendimiento sean siempre vuestra corona más noble. May the blessing of the north be upon you. Que la bendición del norte esté con vosotros. The realm of the east is air. It is air I call forth my children of Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius. I am air, I am fire. I am water, I am earth, we are spirit. Ang kaharian ng silanganan ay hangin. At sinasama ko ang aking mga anak. Gemini, Libra, at Aquarius. Ako ang hangin, ako ang apoy, ako ang lupa, tayo ang diwa. The realms of self fire, and as fire, I call forth my children of Aries, Leo, and Sagittarius. I am air, I am fire, I am water, I am earth. We are spirits. O pedido tu noto, ime fotxa, que os fotxa, calota pediam. Crio, leon, que toxoti. Ime aeras, ime fotxa, ime nero. The realms of the West is water, and as water I call you forth, my children of Cancer, Scorpio, and Pisces. I am air, I am fire, I am water, I am earth, we are spirit. El reino del oeste es el agua. Y como agua, llamo a mis hijos de cáncer, escorpio y piscis. Aire soy, fuego soy, agua soy, tierra soy. Somos espíritu. The realm of north is earth. And as earth, I call forth my children of Taurus, Virgo, and Capricorn. I am air, I am fire. I am water, I am earth, we are spirit. El reino del norte es la tierra, y como tierra que soy, llamo a los hijos de Tauro, Virgo y Capricornio. Aire soy, fuego soy, agua tierra, espíritu soy. Behold the four powers dance, and by their dance a circle is formed, a circle of power recreating the circle of creation. As thought is mother to action, and action is mother to reflection, reflection is mother to understanding, and understanding mother to thought. This is the dance that set the world in motion. It is the dance we dance every day. It is the process of creation. We invoke you, O oh Mother Goddess, you who are the origin of all things, Yours was the small, still voice which spoke before the first creation. 
and speaks in us today. Yours is the heart of infinite love and joy, which guides the universe and which beats within all things. You are the soul of all existence from whom all existence has developed. You are the wind in the trees, the earth beneath our feet, the very atoms of our body. You are the essence of all things. We invoke you, yet we know you are never absent from us, for we carry you always in our hearts. Holy Mother, with love and with respect, we call upon you. We ask you to aid us, to guide us, to move through us as we enact this holy ritual. Beloved Father God, we do invoke you, you who are the vehicle of all things. You are the son, brother, and consort of the goddess. Yours is the light of life, which first emerged when you exploded from the goddess, your mother. Yours, the building blocks of creation from which the seven planes and all things are made. You turn the wheel of the year, the wheel of the zodiac, the wheel of the galaxies at her command. Father God, we invoke you, but we know that you are never absent from us. And we ask you to aid us, to guide us, and to move through us in this our sacred right. Behold, may the great right be enacted. Behold, contemplation, reflection, the sacred power of the West, emotion which is reaction and forms but also obscures our vision and expresses but also hides our true self. But self-examination and attunement with the divine reveals again our true heart and the love and balance which are its natural state. When the goddess pursued the God into the physical and reunited with him, their union brought the soul into the world of matter. But the soul did not know itself and had to search inside itself to find again its true identity, a process still going forward. Symbol of divine love through which God rediscovers goddess, be also the symbol of our love for one another and for all beings and for the divine parents who have given birth to us all. Oh, great mother. You who are known by many names in the hearts of humankind, Brigid, Isis, Lakshmi, Selu, these and many other names, both known and unknown. Whenever we have need of anything, once in a month, and better it be when the moon is full, then we shall assemble in some sacred place and adore you, who are the spirit of the moon. And we shall sing and dance, make music and make love, all in your name, who are the queen of all the wise. And we shall be free from slavery. And as a sign that we are truly free, we shall be open in your rights. For yours is the ecstasy of spirit and yours too, the joys of the senses. And your law is love unto all beings, nor do you demand aught of sacrifice for you are the mother of all living, and your love is poured out upon creation. We shall keep pure this highest ideal, striving ever towards it. Nothing shall turn us aside, for yours is the cup of wine of life, the sacred cauldron, which is the grail of immortality. On earth, you give knowledge of the spirit eternal, and beyond death, you give peace and freedom and reunion with those who have gone before. For you are the gracious goddess, you who gives joy unto the human heart.
Hear now the words of the star goddess. In the dust of whose feet are the hosts of heaven, and whose body encircles the universe. Hear then the words of the god, in the crown of whose head are the millions of lives, whose body is the great dragon of the universe. I am the beauty of the green earth, and the white moon among the stars, and the mystery of the waters. I call unto your soul, arise and come unto me, for I am the soul of nature, who gives life to the universe. I am the forest, the field, the golden sun. I am lightning and fire. I am the Lord of time and space, who turns the wheel and calls the dance of life. From me all things proceed, and unto me all must return. Before my face, O beloved of God and humankind, let your highest self rejoice and be enfolded in the rapture of the infinite. I am the radiant sun who shares his light with earth that all upon her may live. I am the fruitful harvest the vervent greenery, offering my body that all who eat me may thrive. For my worship is in the heart that rejoices. Behold, all acts of love and pleasure are my rituals. Therefore, let there be beauty and strength, power and compassion, honor and humility, mirth and reverence within you. In life, I am the green man, spirit of life and freedom, who spurs all onto growth. And at death, I'm the stag king, with a staff who guards the gate between the worlds. And you seek to find me in the depths of the sea or the shining stars. If you seek me in the green field or the blue sky, or the cry of the stag, or the flight of a hawk, Know that your seeking will avail you not, unless you know the mystery. For if that which you seek you find not within yourself, you will never find it. For behold, I have been with you since the beginning, and I am that which is attained at the end of desire. Behold, know that your seeking God is, is not greater than nor is the god greater than the goddess. Both are equal. Equal. And neither is complete without the other. In the name of God, the name of the goddess god, and the god, may this chalice, may this may this chalice, chalice be blessed. Be blessed. May the book of life be blessed. Behold, the holy book of life, which is also the book of the ancestors. Within this book are inscribed the names of all known Corellians, incarnate and discarnate. The names of the discarnate remain side by side with the names of the incarnate, for we know that death is no separation and that the beloved ancestors are with us still one with us in the great work, which is the birth of the new age and the continual rebirth of the earth. For this ceremony, the names of any Corellians who have joined the beloved in the other world during the previous year are updated in the book as being now among the ancestors. Therefore, may the names of those Corellians who have crossed over during this time now be read out, their souls called forth and honored. May the names of those who have joined the ancestors in the past year and who have requested that their names be read now be called forth. 
These beloved ones have joined the ancestors. Our beloved and longtime priestess, April Hopper, and Cristina Perales Fernandez, better known as Hannah de Madrid, who had many other affiliations as well, but had been part of our Karelian tradition in May of 2017. May you be blessed as you continue your journey. You who are named and those others who have not requested to be named, may you be remembered. May you be honored. Know that you are loved. Honored ones who have joined the ancestors, we stand with you hand in hand, united by the love we share as a family. One family, incarnate and discarnate. Beloved ones, may the blessing be upon you. Join me now in visualizing the gate of the ancestors. May the blessing be. Behold the name of the great mother goddess. May this book be blessed and May all those whose names are in the book be blessed, and may the sacred tradition which they form be blessed. Mother Goddess, grant us purity of heart and clarity of understanding. Be with us and guide us, for we are your children. Behold, in the name of the great Father God, may this book be blessed. May all those whose names are in the book be blessed. And may the sacred tradition which they form be blessed. Father God, bring us prosperity and success. Protect us and keep us safe from all harm, for we are your children. May the blessing be. May the blessing be. So mote it 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 be. May the beloved ancestors be invoked. Because we want our connection to the beloved ancestors to grow stronger, we honor them at this time of the year when life returns and grows stronger in the world. It is the waxing time of the year, and so too we desire our connection to the ancestors and to deity to wax and their influence to increase in our lives. The ancestors whom we honor in this ceremony are not our physical ancestors, although in some cases they may be also. They are our spiritual ancestors. They are the spirits of those who built the Karelian tradition and also those who, while not directly part of the tradition, nonetheless shaped it with their thoughts and lives. All are bound by a common thread. They were called by the goddess and inspired by her to aid in the reshaping of the world and the birthing of the Aquarian age. We are privileged to live at the coming of the age, but it is a great responsibility that rests upon us all spiritual people. For many years, we were called by the goddess to labor as midwives of the age, to prepare the world for a spiritual rebirth and the earth for a new beginning, free of the injustices of the past. Now we must be the teachers of this newborn age. Before us stand the unknown generations to come. Beside us stand the beloved ancestors whose efforts have taught and guided us as we have joined them in the great work. The ancestors were remarkable people in life and are remarkable people in spirit. They were and are healers, teachers, artists, and magicians of the highest caliber. From their work, we who are Corellian priesthood were trained, and it is upon their work that we are built as we grow. Nor is the veil a separation between us, for incarnate and discarnate we stand together, one tradition, one family, straddling life and death, transcending time and space. Beloved ancestors, we honor you.
Behold, in the name of the Karelian nativist tradition, I call forth the spirits of the beloved ancestors. Holy ones, we, your children, your brothers and sisters, physical and spiritual descendants, and incarnations invoke you and call you forth. I call forth the spirit of the ancestors who stand with you in the house, but whom we have not named, beloved all. I call forth the spirits of the ancestors who stand with you, but are not of the house. I call forth the spirit of the ancestors of the Karelian tradition, physical and philosophical, whether written in the book or unknown by name. I call you forth, beloved ones, that we may honor you. May the offerings be brought forward. We make an offering of incense and flowers to you, O siblings of the great family. And, to, and a gift of token of love as we honor you as members of our family. May the blessings be upon you. We make an offering of flour and water to you, O siblings of the great family. In token of respect, we bear for you in gratitude for all your efforts in advancing the great work. May the blessings be upon you. Many generations have come before and many shall follow after. We are not alone, but part of a continuum. We are one with our ancestors and our descendants, united in love and in respect. The work we do has taken and will take many generations, yet it is as the blink of an eye to the eternity of the soul. May the blessings of the ancestors be invoked. Are you ready, beloved one? I am. Hail unto you, O one of ancient days, two-horned lord, master of the forked staff, child of the sun and moon, beloved of the earth. I invoke you, O oh, beloved ancestors. I call upon you and ask you to enter into this, your priest descended from and taught by you, that you may see with his eyes, speak with his voice. Come to us, speak to us, give us your message and your blessing. It gives us joy to see you come together. And we say to you that you shall come together many more times for the future stretches long before you. There will be times in the next year and years beyond when you may question where the roads are going, but we say to you that the roads are going into the new age, reborn and reshaped for the better. The world around you is disintegrating and will rebuild itself. You, our children, must play a role in that rebuilding. You must not abrogate this role, but rather must fulfill it using all that you have learned and all that you have known 
for this is what you have come to do. The work you do now will shape the world of your future incarnations as well as the future of this life. You may not always understand how this is so, but you will come to see that it is so. Not for nothing have we shared with you the knowledge and the skills that we have done, but for this purpose for which we have labored and for which you have labored, and which is only the opening of this time of transformation, you are the guides and guardians of the new age. You are not the only people acting in this capacity, but you have come to act in this capacity and you must do so. You will find you know what needs to be done because the map was made before you were ever born. Though this is not to say the doing will be easy. There is much work ahead, much skill required. And the outcome will not always be evident until well after the fact. But we will guide you and stand beside you. And you guide also yourselves for each one of you has come for this role and carries within yourself the knowledge of what must be done. Before you were ever born, we all made a pact to enact this role at this time for the betterment of the earth. Open your hearts to I'll come to you when it is needed. Know that there is not one of you who does not have a role to play in building a better, kinder, more just world where the blessings of spirit will flow more freely. The essence of spirit manifest more fully than ever before. These are our words to you, our children. We give you our love and our admiration for taking on this work with us. We are one family, hand in hand, carnate and discarnate, living in the world of the physical and the world of the spirit but no wall separates us. We dance the dance of life together. We go forward in this work together, one family, one people, one love between our many hearts. May you be blessed. May the beloved ancestors now give their blessing to their tradition and its members. Behold. Behold these sacred waters, symbol of spirit brought forth for this purpose from the Holy Vermilion River and many other places. May the waters and all they touch be blessed. May the blessing be upon these waters and all they touch. So mote it be. So mote it be. May the sacred blessing of the holy ancestors go forth unto all peoples living in the Karelian tradition. All those whose names appear in this book of life and any who should appear but for any reason have been omitted. All those who live in the flesh and all those who live in spirit, all those who are present at this ceremony and all those who are not present, may the blessing be upon you. May you be blessed 
May you stand with the holy ancestors, even as you stand with the goddess and the god, one with the ancestors as a great Corellian family. May you be guided by the holy ancestors as you walk the paths of spirit, even as the goddess is on your left hand and the god is on your right. May we walk together in honor and happiness. May you be protected by the holy ancestors against all manner of harm and aided by them in time of need even as you are protected and aided by the goddess and God whom we all serve together. May the blessing be upon you. So may it be. May the sacred lustration take place. Behold, may the blessing be upon the Corellians of the East. May the blessing be upon those of us who live in the East. And likewise, upon those who are children of Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius. May the blessing of the beloved ancestors be upon you. And upon all the lands and peoples of the East as well. Narito at inyong kamtan ang pagpapala para sa lahat ng Corellian ng Silanganan. Pagpalain nawa ang lahat ng naninirahan sa silanganan. Join din sa lahat ng mga anak ng Gemini, Libra, at Aquarius. Ang pagpapala na madakilang anito at anino ay sumayinyo. At sa lahat ng kalupaan at mga mamamayan ng silanganan. May the blessing be upon the East. So mote it be. So mote it be. Behold, may be the blessing be upon the Corellians of the South. May the blessing be upon those of us who live in the South, and likewise upon those who are children of Aries, Leo, and Sagittarius. May the blessing of the beloved ancestors be upon you, and upon all the lands and peoples of the South as well. Asine Yevlogies, Mazime Tus Corellianos to Noto. Asine Yevlogies, Mazime Osus Katikunstonoto, Kathos and Pisis, Kemazime Tapedia, Tu Creu, Tu Leonda, Kitu Toxoti. Asine των αγαπημένων των Sprogonon Mazima. Kathos Kemazime Kathegi to Noto, Kemazime Tis Files to Noto Episis. May the blessing be upon the Corellians of the South. So mote it be. So mote it be. So mote it be. Behold, may the blessing be upon the Corellians of the West. May the blessings be upon those of us who live in the West, and likewise upon those who are children of Cancer, Scorpio, and Pisces. May the blessings of the beloved ancestors be upon you and upon all the lands of the peoples of the West as well. May the blessing be upon the Corellians of the West. So would it be. So would it be. Behold, may the blessing be upon the Corellians of the North. May the blessing be upon those of us who live in the North, and likewise upon those who are children of Taurus, Virgo, and Capricorn. May the blessing of the beloved ancestors be upon you and upon all the lands and peoples of the North as well. Que la bendición sea con los, con los correlianos del norte. Que la bendición sea sobre aquellos que vivimos en el norte, sobre los hijos de Tauro, Virgo y Capricornio. Que la bendición de los ancestros sea con todos vosotros, con todas las tierras y con todos los pueblos del norte. So may it be. Así sea. May the Corellians of the north. So may it be. So may it be. So may it be. So may it be. Beloved ancestors, we thank you for your message and for your blessings. 
We pray that you will continue to work with us as we walk the path of spirit and to follow the goddess's call to make the world a better and more spiritual place. May you and may you likewise receive our thanks in token of our love and respect for you. May the toast be offered. This represents the cup, which is blessed at the beginning of our rite. It symbolizes the union of goddess and God, which is the mystery of life. May it also symbolize the bond of love between us as we, the children of the goddess and the God, and as we members and friends of the Karelian tradition. Let us all take up our separate cups. Let us remember again the blessing that is on this cup. May it be a token of our unity and of our love we bear for one another. To the God, to the goddess, to us. To us. us. To the spirits. So, we have come to the most dreaded part of the ceremony, the announcement section. Yeah. I have notes. On behalf of the first priestess, Lady Stephanie and myself, we would like to begin by offering our thanks to all those who have worked to put on this event. We would like to thank the host temples, the dancers of Shakti and holistic knowledge and their temple heads, the arch priestess, first elder, Alyssa Maxenkamp and the arch priest, the right reverend Sir Phoenix Coffin Williams. Thank you for all your hard work. And thank you also to the members of your temple. I'd just like to say congratulations everybody. And from me and Lord Phoenix, thank you all for participating. Thank you all for watching. Thank you to our amazing ASL interpreter, Elizabeth Bull. Thank you to all of our quarter callers who shared with us their native language. Uh, we appreciate you all, we love you all. Thank you so much. Bless be. And thank you also to all of the wonderful presenters who have taken part in this illustration. I'm not going to try to name everyone because there have been very many, but I want to thank the English language presenters and the Spanish language presenters, all of whom have done a wonderful job. Thank you so much. We want to thank our sacred grandmother, the arch priestess, Sir Angela Munn, for running the largest temple deeming ceremony we have ever seen in a timely and effective manner with which we are endlessly impressed. <laughs> and we would like to thank the Order of Paladins, Paladin General Sir Ed Hubbard and the Reverend Sir Ebony Nash for running the technical end of this event and doing such a wonderful job. Thank you all. We also want to thank all of the people who have attended this event. Thank you for joining us. And we'd also like to thank the host temples for their kind donation of the monies raised by the fee for this event to the support of CEM Broadcasting. Thank you 
It was much appreciated. And we will continue to bring many wonderful events to our Karelian tradition and our pagan community and the wider world in the future. I would now like to ask our sacred grandmother, the Arch Priestess Sir Angela Mann, uh, to come forward and offer the results of the deeming ceremony. I am pleased to say that we have accepted all of the advancements and Lady Angela will now enunciate them. We have six Wiccan shrines advancing to proto-temple status, and they are as follows. Wild Moon Proto-Temple, located in England. Mystic Labyrinth Proto-Temple in France. Arboleda del Awen Proto-Temple, located in Spain. Santuaria de Nemesis, located in Spain. Twilight's Ember Proto-Temple, located in Oklahoma, USA. Circle of the Mountain Fire Proto Temple located in Colorado, USA. We have five Proto Temples advancing to temple status. Temple Arcer located in Massachusetts, USA. Our Lady of the Healing Fields located in Michigan, USA. Four Pillars Temple located in Ohio, USA. Celtic Crow Temple located in Georgia, USA and Templo Tierra de Gracia, located in Venezuela. Congratulations to all of these groups, and thank you. I have, I have to say that when I was young, the ancestors said to us that the Corellian tradition would be all over the world one day. But to actually see it is immensely gratifying. And when I, when I hear their words for the future, I remember the accuracy of their words for the past. Now, I would like to yield the floor to Her Eminence, the First Priestess, Lady Stephanie Nino. Thank you, Chancellor Don. And this is the time where we present the Krillian Awards. And though we give these words today, know that we recognize there are many, many more working uh, in dedication for this tradition and we appreciate you. The Order of the Iron Pentacle, we present to Reverend Hesley Belterex de Ferra and Reverend Claudia Andrea Montoya Vasquez. Also, Reverend Thilia and Reverend Monica Salas. And Reverend Stacy Blair. Order of the Copper Athame. Alvin L. Sentin, otherwise known as Laki Agama, Aghama. Order of the Golden Wand, Reverend Sir Ebony Nash, Reverend Sir Emerald Earthhard Hart Gray, Reverend Sir Scott Hale, Right Reverend Sir Lori Denman, Reverend Luxfero Morningstar, Sir John Joseph Gonzalez. Next, Order of the Obsidian Mirror, Reverend Melinda Whitley, Reverend Sir Ebony Nash. Aaron Err, Order of the Round Table. Today we give this award post, posthuma, post, posthumous, po, posthumously, sorry, never can pronounce that. So we lovingly 
give this gift posthumously to Lady Jana D. Madrid. Thank you for your service, everyone. I turn it over to you, Chancellor Don. Thank you. I have to say that I, I am overwhelmed to be surrounded by our Karelian family. In this ritual today, we have people from across North America, throughout the United States, Central and South America, from Spain, from Africa, from the Philippines, from Greece, from the UK, from so many places around the world, all together as one family. When we look at the world, we do not always see the bright and hopeful things, but I think when we look at each other, we can see a bright and hopeful future. And I thank you, all of you, for being part of that future. And with that, we conclude the announcement section. May thanks be given. Normally, we would now join hands in token of the sacred circle, but of course, we cannot literally do so in this format. Therefore, let us join hearts. Though we are not physically together, let us make a perfect circle in spirit to symbolize the circle we have been in throughout this rite. Behold, integration, understanding, the sacred power of the North. It is Ouroboros, the serpent swallowing its own tail. The return to the beginning. For the cycle of creation is fulfilled when the created becomes the creator. The soul is not only its origin in the goddess, but also its destination. The reunion of soul and creator is not a displacing of one by the other, but a realization that both have been one all along that the journey has been shared at every step and union not delayed, but temporarily obscured by the veil of flesh. We are the one and our journey is one of enrichment and magnification beyond our original dreams and imaginings out of which we will emerge immeasurably greater than we began, expanded and glorified a million fold. Symbol of eternity and completion through which existence is fulfilled and goddess and God not merely reunited, but made one again. Be also the symbol of our thanks and gratitude for the wonders of this life and the joy of creation. Let us give thanks. We thank the beloved ancestors, both named and unnamed for their presence and their blessing. Guide and protect our tradition, O oh beloved ones, that we may flourish and grow and help us to be true to the will of deity in all things with love and with respect, we thank you. May the blessing be upon you now and always. We thank you, O oh Father God, for your presence in this our right and your presence at all times in our hearts. You who are the vehicle of all things, the Lord of beginnings and endings of time and space, we thank you with love and with respect. And knowing you are always with us, yet from respect, we bid you hail and farewell. Hail, hail and farewell. We thank you, O oh Mother Goddess, heart of existence, source of sustenance of all things, for your presence and your aid now in this our ritual and at all times in life, for yours is the face mirrored in all things, and you are never separate from we who are your children and the expression of your essence. Help us always to see the beauty in all things and to remember that we are part and parcel of the whole 
cells in the body of Gaia, all creatures, our relations, and fellow manifestations of your heart's yearnings. With love and with respect, we thank you. May the blessing be upon you now and always. May thanks be given unto the gods, lands, and peoples of the north. May the blessing be upon them and all their works. May all the gods of the north, both named and unnamed, be thanked and honored by all hearts. May all the lands of the north be fruitful and prosperous. May all the peoples of the north know peace and joy. May every road of the north be opened. May every heart of the north be opened. May the goddess bless the north now and always, gods, lands, and peoples of the north. May there be peace between us. And always, with love and with respect, we thank you. May the blessing be. May the blessings be upon the powers of the north. Damos las gracias a los dioses, tierras y pueblos del norte. Que la bendición sea con ellos y sus obras. Que todos los dioses del norte, conocidos y desconocidos, sean agradecidos y honrados por todos los corazones. Que las tierras del norte sean fructíferas y prósperas. Que los pueblos del norte conozcan la paz y la alegría. Que los caminos del norte se abran. Que cada corazón del norte se abra. Que la diosa bendiga al norte ahora y siempre. Dioses, tierras y pueblos del norte, que haya paz entre nosotros ahora y siempre. Os damos las gracias en perfecto amor y perfecta confianza. Benditos seáis. Que la bendición sea con los poderes del norte. May the blessing be upon the powers of the north. May thanks be given unto the gods, lands, and peoples of the West. May the blessings be upon them and all their works. May all the gods of the West, both named and unnamed, be thanked and honored in all our hearts. May all the lands of the West be fruitful and prosperous. May all the peoples of the West know peace and joy. May every road of the West be opened. May every heart of the West be opened. May the goddess bless the west now and always god's lands and peoples of the west may there be peace between us now and always with love and with respect we thank you may the blessings be may the blessings be upon the powers of the west damos las gracias a los dioses las tierras y los pueblos del oeste que la bendición carga sobre ellos y todas sus obras. Que todos los dioses del oeste, tanto con nombre como sin nombre, sean agradecidos y honrados por todos los corazones. Que todas las tierras del oeste sean fructíferas y prósperas. Que todos los pueblos del oeste conozcan la paz y la alegría. Que todos los caminos del oeste se abran. Que cada corazón del oeste se abra. Que la diosa bendiga el oeste ahora. Y siempre, dioses, tierras y pueblos del oeste, que haya paz entre nosotros ahora y siempre. Con amor y con respeto, os damos las gracias. Bendito seáis. May thanks be given unto the gods, lands and people of the south. May the blessing be upon them and their works. May all the gods of the south, both named and unnamed, be thanked and honored by all hearts. May all the lands of the South be fruitful and prosperous. May all the peoples of the South know peace and joy. May every road of the South be opened. May every heart of the South be opened. May the goddess bless the South now and always. Gods, lands, and people of the South, may there be peace between us now and always. With love and with respect, we thank you. May the blessing be, may the blessing be upon the powers of the South. As the Thun of Haristias, to Steus, Stis Files, and the Gay to Notu, as seen a mazitus evlogies, evlogimena seen a tairgatus, as seen a only the Gay to Notu, 
ονομαστή ή ανώνυμη, τιμημένη και αγαπητή από όλες τις καρδιές. Ας είναι κάθε γη του Νότου ευημερούσα και γόνιμη. Ας γνωρίζουν όλες οι φυλές του Νότου ειρήνη και χαρά. Ας είναι κάθε δρόμος του Νότου ανοιχτός. Ας είναι κάθε καρδιά του Νότου ανοιχτή. Ας ευλογεί η Θεά το Νότο, τώρα και πάντοτε. Θεοί, γη και φυλές του Νότου, ας υπάρχει ειρήνη ανάμεσά μας, τώρα και πάντοτε. Με αγάπη και σεβασμό σας ευχαριστούμε. Ας είναι οι ευλογίες μαζί με τις δυνάμεις του Νότου. These things be given unto the gods, sons, and peoples of the East. May the blessing be upon them and all their works. May all the gods of the East, both named and unnamed, be thanked and honored by all hearts. May all the lands of the East be fruitful and, be fruitful and pr prosperous. May all the peoples of the East know peace and joy. May every road of the East be open. May every heart of the East be open. May the goddess bless the East now and always. Gods, lands, and peoples of the East, may there be peace between us, now and always. With love and with respect, we thank you. May the blessing be, may the blessing be upon the powers of the East. Pasasalamat sa mga dakilang diwata, kalupahan, at mga nilalang ng silanganan, at pagpapala ay sumain niyo, at sa inyong mga gawa, Pasalamatan at parangalan ng ating mga puso ang lahat ng mga duwata ng silanganan. Silang mga napangalanan at mga hindi pa natatanyag. Maging maunlad at masagana ang lahat ng lupain ng silanganan. Kamuhin ng lahat ng ninilang sa silanganan ang kapayapaan at kaligayahan. Maging bukas na wa ang lahat ng daan sa silanganan at ang bawat puso sa silanganan ay manatili bukas. At tanggapin ang pagpapala ng mga diwata sa silanganan ng palagian. O mga diwata, kalupaan at lahat ng mga nilalang sa silanganan. Tumibay nawa ang kapayapaan sa pagitan natin ngayon at magpakailanman. Buong buong puso ng pagmamahal at pagtitiwala ay nagpapasalamat kami. Sumayin nyo nawa ang pagpapala ng kapangyarihan ng silanganan. Basbasan nawa. As above, so below. So below. As the universe, so the soul. So the soul. As without, so, so within. within. Behold, the circle is open, yet never broken. Mary, meet. Mary, part, part. And Mary, Mary meet again. Meet again. Thank <laughs> you.